Hi, I'm John from WorkshopAddict.com. A little while back, I did a review of the Kent CNC dust shoe for the X-Carve. And um, nice unit. It's, I really, really like the way it works. It's made working with the X-Carve so much nicer. Um, but one of the complaints I had were the bristles were a little bit too stiff on this, so we had to raise the shoe up. Otherwise, the stiff bristles would cause um, the router to not keep a consistent depth and after doing this review and Kent CNC seeing this review, seeing the, the review, um, they contacted me and said that, um, that this was you know, a prototype unit and they're aware of the issue and they've already made the fix. So they sent me this new dust ring and it works the same as before. The only difference is, is these bristles are way, way, way less stiff. Um, the bristles on this unit are actually like you'd find on like a scrub brush. It's pretty heavy duty, and I believe this is what they use for some of their bigger heavy duty dust rings. But this new one is very, very soft, very, you know, not stiff at all. Um, just to give you an idea, if we take the old dust ring, set the new one on top of it, you know, it's gonna sit there. It's pretty stiff. If we put the new one on the bottom, put the old one on the top, it just falls over. Now, it might not seem like much, but this has made a world of difference in how this dust shoe performs. Now I can keep the dust shoe down at the bottom, right at the wood level when we're starting out, so it captures all the dust. Leaving it up like I had to before would allow dust to escape and you'd have some around. And uh, now this can sit right along and the bristles will fold like it needs to and uh, everything's great. So if you were thinking about getting one of these and you saw my comments about this staying up a little bit higher, um, fear not, they've made the changes and the bristles are really nice now. So I'm glad to get some company feedback on this and uh, hopefully this helps you guys out. Um, until next time, I'm John from WorkshopAddict.com. Talk to you later.